Hi guys, this is Colin with Print Your Mind 3D. I'm here today to show you how to use Ultimaker's Cura 3.0 to calculate material cost for a given item. So it's, this is a, a great feature for businesses, makerspaces, libraries, anywhere where you need to be able to calculate the exact cost for a given print. This is a, a fantastic feature to help with that. So the first thing to note is you have to have something actually loaded into your build area. So in this case, I have a Benchy, and we can see this is going to take about an hour and a half, and it's going to use 12 grams of material. So in order to have this calculate an actual cost for that, the first thing we're going to do is come over to this material section, and we're going to select Manage Materials. So by default, Cura will have the currency selected in euros. So the first thing you want to do is come over here and go to general and import and select dollars. So in this case for me, this is Canadian dollars. And then if we go back to materials, and in this case, I'm working with Ultimaker's yellow PLA. So the cost of this material, again in Canadian dollars, is $54.95. So under the filament cost, you're going to enter that $54.95, whatever your cost happens to be. And then under filament weight, we're going to enter 750 grams, because Ultimaker sells their spools in 750 gram spools. So now you can see while I have this Ultimaker Yellow PLA selected, it now gives me a cost of 93 cents to produce this Benchy. So we can apply this to many different materials. So if I wanted to, for example, print this in black Ultimaker nylon, this material is a bit more expensive. So this is actually 89.95 for a 750 gram spool. So again, we're just going to come and so you just select your material. So in this case, black nylon. You go into the filament cost, enter that cost, and then enter the weight, which in this case is 750 grams. So now, if I select that I'm going to be printing in Ultimaker black nylon, Kura is just going to re-slice this. As you can see now, it's actually changed my image to black. Just re-slicing. And now we can see that in this case, with black nylon, this would actually cost $1.54. So that is how you can use the feature to create a item cost or a print cost using Ultimaker's Kura 3.0. So thank you guys for watching, and for all your 3D printing needs, head over to printyourmind3d.ca.